One of the most interesting findings from the study relates to something called presenteeism. Now, we're all familiar with absenteeism, and that's where somebody is unwell and doesn't come to work. With presenteeism, the person is feeling unwell, but does actually come to work because they feel they have to be there. And about a third of employers in the survey reckoned that presenteeism was an important issue for them in their organizations. Now, research, particularly research in America, shows that presenteeism can reduce productivity in an organization by as much as a third. So increasingly, I think, tackling presenteeism, identifying it, measuring it, and finding ways to intervene will become more and more important for modern organizations. For those patients who aren't complaining of being tired all the time, sometimes abbreviated into TATT, clearly their productivity is going to be lowered in the workplace. Their stress levels are going to go up. For a very small input on the part of the employer, they can get a very significant Turn. Some of the interventions can be uh, very, very simple. As some employees in the survey mentioned that they would like to have advice on nutrition and lifestyle and exercise. Some of them would like some information on managing stress. And so many of these programs can easily be built in to the workplace.